an entirely new AR platform with a revolutionary new product. And here it is. Apple announced on Monday its latest Apple Vision Pro headset at the Apple's Worldwide Developers Conference. This spatial computer, as Apple calls it, aims to blend digital content with one's physical space. Well, comparing it with its competitors such as Meta Quest 3, PlayStation VR 2 and HTC Vive Pro 2, is Apple Vision Pro worth the hype? Let's look into Meta Quest 3. Meta Quest 3 has its focus as a mixed reality gaming headset with Meta Reality technology. Compared to Apple's M2 chip, the Quest 3 will most probably come with Qualcomm's XR2 Plus Gen 1 chip, which is derived from a smartphone chip. The Quest 3 is chunkier when compared to the Vision Pro and is mainly controlled using two controllers while it can also be used with hand gestures. Though the device can access internet and view movies, the Quest 3 is primarily a gaming device with a very vast library of VR games, but does not have the connect that Vision Pro will have to the Apple ecosystem. The prices starting for Quest 3 starts at $500. Moving on to PlayStation VR 2, Unlike the Vision Pro or the Quest 3, the PS VR 2 is a device capable only used for VR purposes. It does have a pass-through mode that is only black and white and does not allow AR immersion. The displays on the PS VR 2 are two 2000 into 2040 OLED displays with 4K HDR capabilities and refresh rates up to 90 by 120 Hz. The PSVR 2 also provides the user with an immersive audio experience using Sony's Tempest 3D audio tech. But unlike the Vision Pro, the PSVR 2 is plugged into the PS5 for both its computing capabilities and power supply, making it a comparatively stationary experience. Controllers of the PSVR 2 use similar technology to the newer DualSense controllers since its primary and only use is for gaming and the headset does not work with any PC or any other machine. The price of the PSVR 2 headset is $549. Now let's look into HTC Vive Pro 2. Similar to the PSVR 2, the Vive Pro 2 is also a headset purely built with VR capabilities and also has a see-through mode that does not allow for AR capabilities. The display resolution, however, is 2448 into 2448, but with an LCD display, in a category where most people would prefer an OLED display like the Vision Pro. The headset does not have a chip of its own, but the PC, it is tethered to have a Intel Core i5-4590 or AMD Ryzen 1500 equivalent processor or greater. It is to be powered externally and uses controllers since it's purely for gaming. However, it does have access to the Steam VR library, which has a huge array of games to choose from. The full kit along with all of these accessories is priced at $1249. Now, let's look into the other highlights of the Vision Pro, including an M2 processor, 4K display, spatial audio for an immersive experience, 12 cameras, 5 sensors and 6 microphones. This is to ensure that content feels like it is appearing right in front of the user's eyes in real time. Arwen streams new image to the displays within 12 milliseconds, 8 times faster than the blink of an eye. Apple Vision Pro is designed for all-day use when plugged in and up to two hours of use with its external high-performance battery. The pricing of the Apple Vision Pro is $3,499 and will be available next year.